And welcome everyone back finally after so long to Destiny 1. Otherwise known as Let's Play Destiny Titan, which is originally what I tried to do, but um my system back then had, was still playing tricks on me. But it's not gonna be doing so anymore. Anyways. So apparently this game has somewhat had a revival. I don't know, I know a lot of people are like, screw Destiny 2. Let's hit the B button so they button. Damn switched. <laughs> Damn switch. Um, yeah. Which is a bit sad. But then again, that means that Destiny 1 will have people playing it. Which is good on my itch part. So yeah, so I'm doing a different let's play for each character. And um, what I decided to do is to do a continuation of it. So, um, Destiny 1's uh, my, you know, normal let's play Destiny. So the Warlock one. It's going to continue to being just Let's Play Destiny, and then I'll have a little um, dash and then put in, you know, um, the Dark Below, or whatever. Yeah. We'll see about doing um, raids. Yeah, I'm going to bloody do the raids. Scott. I'm just a terrible human being. Hmm, that's interesting. Nope. So yeah, um, <clears throat> I had actually done an extra hour, so if you remember, there was just like a weird video that was up that was just like Destiny. Oh shoot, they actually changed my clan here as well. Hmm, curious. I'm sad that there's no um, intro thing for Dark Below or House of Wolves. I did actually see the House of Wolves. Weren't they like traveling through a bunch of snow or whatever? I don't know. But um, I'm mostly checking if I have. I. Jeez, it's been so long. Items that I shouldn't. Which I do not. Ornaments. So I didn't actually have to do this. And no, just in case you were wondering, no, I am not going to be playing this. I'm going to be restarting the character. However, on one hand, I do actually need to change how he looks. So I actually need to be in non-combat zone anyways. Yeah, wow, look at that. There are people playing. Is that how I look? Hold the phone. That is not how I'm supposed to look. Alright. I need a completely, um, is this going to go all the way out? Hopefully. Yes. Delete you. All the way. Yep. Titan. He is a male exo. Um, I think about it. Because my um, real Titan, I think, looks in the Destiny 2 like my old original title, Titan does, so. That would work, wouldn't it? Hold on. But instead, I'm going to go to Destiny 2, the PS4 version. Into cutscene. There he is. Hey, stop that. Okay.
So we actually had that. Interesting enough. His skin color was purple. Mouth I can't actually see. I don't have an eye color. Just have sensors. Head feature had um you know the little side things. Which I can't actually tell what color they are. Markings. They were um gray not like that gray. They weren't black either. As I cut to an even darker black. What color were they? Something like that maybe? I mean I suppose it's possible. Yeah, hold on. Face Did they change? I don't know what's up with his head. They were gray as well. It was like a darker gray than that. Like this gray. Yeah, like that gray. No. No, it was that color. It doesn't provide you the same colors. Well, it seems for the most part it does. They're just moved around for some reason. Let's see. It was a darker blue. Sorry, but this is kind of really important to me. I don't know why in the different positions. Damn you. Oh, thank goodness. You were something like that. Yeah, I think that was it. I mean, I suppose it is possible. That they're changed between Destiny 2 and Destiny 1. I don't know, let's just feel like, um, like, you know, super nostalgia happy if they see this intro. So the only way to see this is to restart a game. Oh my goodness, and they have the Kvastov. Planet Mars, present day. It's good that they put it as a natural map. <laughs> you guys ready to get them back here? A couple days, May 8th. Just need to survive my finals. Why isn't that color available for us for skinning our Kvostov? Or there she is? I think they called a traveler female at one point in one of the things. I never 
realize that the markings were actually were something different. We called it the Traveler, and its arrival changed us forever. Great cities were built on Mars and Venus. Mercury became a garden world. Which we've actually seen what that looks like now. It was a time of miracles. We stared out at the galaxy and knew that it was our destiny to walk in the light of other stars. But the Traveler had an enemy. A darkness which had hunted it for eons across the black gulfs of space. Centuries after oh, goodbye, the Jupiter. Golden Age began. Goodbye, Sen. This darkness. And we'll see Uranus falls. and... And that was the end no. of everything. But it was also a beginning. <laughs> I'm not so happy about that. I w I don't know. I wish they I wish they had just left. In an automatic system, because like Xur is an automatic system, stuff like that, just <clears throat> to make it so like Iron Banner will come back. Cosmodome, Old Russia, Earth. <coughs> um, Trials of Osiris should have just stayed, because again, it's an automatic system. They don't decide, I don't think they decide what matches go on, like, you know, where the maps are. I feel special being on a raised pedestal. Uh, and I also wish you could switch Ghost's voice back for just the intro. I, I sort of wish they went with the original plan with Taken King. They were going to have Nolan um, Ghost be a ghost you bring back from the dead or whatever. Ouch. Nope, they added that to him. Because they didn't put in... Um, it's like the one extra line of dialogue that they added to the main story. Which of course means that they could have redone Dark Below and House of Wolves. Is it possible? There you are. Been hundreds of years, honey. Guardian? Eyes up, Guardian. Word. You're alive. You don't know how long I've been looking for you. I'm a ghost. Actually, now I'm your ghost. And you? Well, you've been dead a long time. So you're going to see a lot of things you won't understand. Like that? This is fallen territory. We aren't safe here. I have to get you to the zoo. Do I know what fawn is? I mean, I know what vex is, right? Don't worry. I'm still with you. You need to move fast. You guys rem remember the magic of this? Why the loading screen, though? We won't survive long out in the open like this. Let's get inside the wall. Oh yeah, I have to relearn everything. Not only relearn. But like, I don't want my jumps. Also, I'm not going to be taking in my um, weapons out of the vault. That's just for um, the you Warlock version. We need to find you a weapon before the Fallen find us. It's a bit dark. Do all four weapons protect you from the Fallen? They're right above us. One thing I will do is I will take, um, hello, Gov. My, um, Hang tight. Fall and thrive in the dark. shell. We won't. We need more light. I'll see what I can do. 
Oh yeah, they have this fawn looking at you from the darkness. It's the very beginning. Thank you. I hope you know how to use that thing. I hope so too. What was that? Wait a while to skip them. Ha! Huh. Oh yeah, my punches don't instantly kill anymore, I guess. I guess, yeah, having them charge. Actually, that doesn't even matter? I, I feel like they might have just... Oh, sorry. I missed my cue. I feel like they might have just increased the damage for um, melee in general. So, yeah, if you guys want to go on, like, the raids, I want to do every single version of the raid and every single version of Prison of Elders. Like, Prison of Elders, I'm pretty sure... Um, Vina, uh, well... That's the Wolf's Prison of Elders. Still has um, its rotation thing. Because I still only uh, fight scores on it. Yeah, I'm actually excited to the raids now. It actually really helps out with Destiny 2. Keep it up. A loot cache. Get a shotgun. Let's see what's inside. Preacher Mark 20. Trip mines. Don't touch them. Well, do a bit of fallen machinery. What are you guys doing? Fine. The shotgun blast I wanted for you. Wait, don't, don't. They're just activating their own mines. Was it some of them my bullets did that? How dare you. Ah, uh, yeah, shotguns are. Wait, this is Destiny 1. Shotguns should instantly kill everything, right? From across the map. What's the devils? Oh, oh yeah, the fallen houses. Yeah, they, they don't really exist anymore, do they? So I guess this is Destiny 1 with a perspective from Destiny 2. She killed that one this time. Yeah, nice try, buddy. The fallen have a tighter hold on this place than I thought. Just a little <laughs> bit. Not for much longer. Let's hope there's something left out there. This was an old cosmodrome. You like the cosmodrome. Incoming. Fallen ships. This close to the surface. Move. It's coming for straight for us. Oh, that was a pressure blast from over there. No, oh, they're shooting at me. I can't jump. Should remember that. So wrong. I'm kind of happy that I decided to record Destiny One today instead of Destiny Two. Issues. Issues, issues. I think there's not any enemies in here. It's a shame that you can't ever redo this mission without redoing everything. To be fair, I need the quests as well.
Gotcha. And level two. I'm picking up signs of an old jump ship. Could be our ticket out of here. Any jump ship I won't be using? And I'll be a lot, it'll be a lot easier to progress with missions and stuff when I'm not like, is this the next mission? Well, I'll look at the light level and help me that much. I think if I remember from like three, four years ago, is There's what it was. Clear them out. Run, Devil Captain. Good old Ron. I don't hear anyone ever talk about him. Our first captain. Oh yeah, and the Grimoire series for this game is gonna start soon as well. I just hope there's a multiplayer scene still. Heck, I hope there's a strike scene for Sepix, honestly. Alright. Let me see what? if I can get us out. Wait a second. I can go through it. I guess that's one way to get in. How do my little like ear nubs go? Hasn't made a jump in centuries. We're lucky the fallen haven't completely picked it clean. Will it fly? Remember we have a voice? I can make it work. There's overriding systems and stuff. Okay, it's not going to break orbit, but it just might get us to the city. Now, above that transmitter. You do it now. I guess just in the central body is where we are. I guess forward is probably like sensors. You guys remember that she's a character? Cause it's kinda hard to remember sometimes, don't you think? Anyway, it's just me. No, I'm pretty sure it's not just me. And now these actually mean something. Got my Arcadian jump ship. Arcadia class jump ship. Canes were the most common jump ships during the Golden Age, used for both terrestrial and planetary excursions. Canes are reported around most Earth based spaceports. So, I guess in the PS4 version of this, I'm just gonna use the jump ship the entire time. I don't know. You know, for the main story till we're done. Which is, it's just gonna end up being Let's Play Destiny, I guess. Bit loud. Just the voice at the beginning was really quiet. And the intro cutscene. Oh, I just re- Wow. I never realized there was actually a storm at the beginning of Destiny 1 as well as Destiny 2. Oh, the tower. Is it just me or was like, is ha Yep, the tower is actually loading in. I never noticed that. What is that? There's the bottom half of the tower that we never see. Fuck the memories. Welcome to the last safe city on Earth. The only place the traveler can still protect. It took centuries to build. Now, we're counting every day it stands. And this tower is where the Guardians live.
Is it open back? Yeah, it, oh my god. It's a back open. Also, was that flash? Anyways. There's this room between missions and stuff. I think. Well, you know, once a tower loads. Yep, time rises. Yeah, I wish they, uh, who knows, maybe they will eventually, I don't know. Mayhaps if Warmind fails utterly, well, honestly, if Warmind fails utterly, then we're in a difficult spot. Because either it'll be either that, um, the Destiny 2's Taken King has to be utterly amazing. Or, well... Warmind might be the very last deal, might be the very last bit of destiny we ever see. I don't know if that happens, I just, I just hope that they're like, hey, we'll go back to Destiny 1 and, you know, we'll reignite it. Yeah, look at all, there's a level 6 and level 13, yes! Yes, the game's still alive! Yes. Hello, my friend. Let's do this. Next time, though, so, enjoy this video, you know what to do. See ya.